Rob. Uh, well, Rob, you're holding the match four. Yeah. You've got three today. You could have had even more. Yeah, there's a couple of chances I probably should have scored, but we've got, we've got the win, which is the most important thing. And it's always nice to get a goal and then a hat trick even better. The manager said he didn't quite know whether to uh, pat you on the back, congratulate you, or just have a little bit of a shout at you because he thought you should have taken the other chances you had as well. Yeah, well, it's, it's frustrating. We just got to keep going, and when the next chance comes, we got to take it. And luckily, I did. So it's, it's, it's good, and most importantly, I said it before, we got the win. And it was an important goal, wasn't it? Because you'd just gone behind 2 1 down when you got the header just before half time. Yeah, well, it was massive. We got a good start. We started off well, got an early goal, and then we conceded two sloppy goals again. So it was important we did get back into the game, especially before half time, and then we could build on that half time. But we weren't, we weren't at our best in the first half, and we got like, regrouped in the changing rooms and kicked on in the second half. What did the manager say at half time? Well, he just said it weren't good enough. We just like, didn't know why we wanted it or. They, they were first to lock all the balls in that, so we just had to lift it. He said we need to lift it a lot, and luckily we did. And the goals, Joe Clark with a oh, good one, yeah, yeah. and then yourself to get a hat trick. Yeah, well, the gaffer was saying I'll score the hardest chance, so, but yeah, there's, there's some good goals today. I think Joe's ball from the second goal was fantastic as well. And Keats did a similar one for him. <laughs> Keats did a similar one for him against Oxford, so he's, he's a great ball boy, Joe, as well. You're still outside the change rooms here and all your <laughs> player, teammates going past so uh, congratulations yeah, so from them I've said one bit well done <laughs> <laughs> but is that your first um, that's your first hat trick for Wrexham, Wrexham? Yeah, I've got one up at East Fife when I was on loan up there but some of the lads are saying it didn't count so <laughs> no disrespect to them but yeah <laughs> it's, it's, it's my first Wrexham hat trick which is good and hopefully I can build on that and get some more goals in the second half of the season so when, when was the last time you actually scored uh, three goals oh it was on my uh, debut up in Scotland a couple of years ago now so two and a half years ago there. Well, well done today. I mean, on that, it's a big win, though. Most importantly, I suppose, for the club, isn't it? Yeah, well, definitely. After the disappointment of a uh, Boxing Day, which I thought we should have got something out of the game, and then sloppy goals again. We really needed to bounce back, and the, the, the support was top class today. A lot coming over here, so it was, it was important we got the win. How low was the feeling after that Alfreton game? I mean, it was a tough one to pick yourselves up for this game or was it quite easy because you know so quickly after that game well it gives you a bit of motivation to kick on again as obviously everyone was disappointed after the Alfredton game since the lose in that manner conceding so late but they're a, they're a hard team to play and we've got to go again on uh, New Year's Day what's the feeling inside the dressing room well, there's 10 points now the gap between yourselves and the playoff positions can you do it do you think I think there's a, there's a lot of chance we've got the quality in the team and they've got a good team spirit here so there's all chance we can uh, kick on and we get a good run to run get our way for right I reckon that's every chance in the world what's it going to take though realistically you're going to have to win what six, seven, eight, maybe more games on the ro- in a row aren't you yeah, yeah well we've seen it um, last year with Mansfield and Kiddy they really <laughs> they really kicked on um, last year so I think you get a run together in this league you've seen the teams at the top we, on paper we should be better than them so I think if we get a run together we definitely have a chance of kicking on there well done today thanks, thanks for thank you very much thank you very much